Hello again everybody and welcome to another new series and a brand new video to the channel. Today we're going to be playing the very gorgeous, very stunning looking Persona 3 Reload. So just like with Persona 3 Portable, I'm going to be playing this game on the highest difficulty, which is Merciless. Free for my soul please, because I'm already getting stressed out. I'm loving all the changes, I'm loving all of the voice actors, I'm loving the music. It's, it's all just so good, this is why I love Persona, it's like the greatest ever. If you're new to the channel, I make a lot of JRPG gameplays. A lot of my videos are very long, but that just means there's more to watch. And and if you do enjoy it, then please don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a little comment, if you want. It's entirely up to you. Right, let's get on with the video then. All I want you to do is just to sit down, relax, enjoy yourself, grab the saltiest snacks you can find, and have fun. Here we go. Persona 3 Reload. Been waiting for this for a while. I mean, I got this the other day. There's no music for some reason. That's always concerning. I'm going to play on Merciless difficulty. Might as well. I mean, I did uh, Persona 3 Portable on the hardest difficulty, which I think was very hard, so... Be a bit stupid if I didn't go on Merciless. Something I'm going to regret at a later time. Oh, this looks so much better than... I mean, obviously it's not looking so much better than Portable already. But, like, I'm just looking at this thinking, finally, I'm playing Persona 3 and things are moving, not just being still images. Uh-oh, it's midnight. We all know what that means. Oh, this looks so gorgeous in, like, the new game. It's so nice looking like this. We're just... I love how he just looks around, like, huh... All the lights went off and everything is green. This is normal. I wonder why my music stopped playing though. He just completely became oblivious to the fact his music went off. Oh, blood in the street. That's something normal. I arrived so late. I better hurry up. <laughs> I wonder where everybody suddenly went and why there's blood everywhere. Oh well, it's of no concern of mine. Huh, I wonder why there are these random coffins in the street with blood everywhere. Well, not my problem. Time to go to the dorm. I actually don't know which one I'm supposed to go. Oh, uh... <laughs> Never mind, I found it immediately. Sure is rather ominous in here. Welcome. Hi, mysterious boy. Where did you come from? If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. Okay, mysterious child in a prison uniform who keeps disappearing and is speaking in a rather ominous tone. I, I, I trust you. Please enter your character's name. I mean, we had girly girl face in Persona 3 Portable, so I think it's only fair to have this specific name for the male character. Hello, my name is Manly Boyface. How are you here at this hour? I, I arrived here by train and then I walked. Is something wrong with me being here at this hour? My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in this storm. Nice to meet you. I'm Manly Boyface. That's a name I'm going to have to get used to saying because I'm so used to saying, yeah, I'm girly girl face. This is Yukari Takeba. Hi, Yukari. Can I ask you a question? Why do you have a gun? Huh? Well, uh, it's sort of like a hobby. Are you serious? You know how it is these days. It's for self-defense. I mean, if you want something for self-defense, then why don't you take up karate or something? I mean, why do you have to go straight in for the gun? It's not a real gun, of course. Oh, sweet Jesus. As soon as people realize the word replica is written on the side of that gun, they're gonna go straight in for her. This does look so much nicer. I do like this. I mean, honestly, anything is an upgrade from moving around as an arrow above the map with still images. The school's so open as well. I like this. This is so good. Oh, are you the new student? I am, yes. My name is Manly Boyface. I'm Ms. Toriumi. I teach composition. Welcome to our school. Okay, I gotta ask, what the hell is composition? What's your first name? You don't need to know my first name. Don't ask such things of a teacher. Oh, I mean, you know, I'm sorry, but I thought the whole point of school was learning. I want to learn more about you, Miss Toriyumi. I got brushed off. <laughs> she brushed me off. God damn it. Why is it always the hot chicks that brush me off? Maybe I could have gotten a different response if I had enough charm to be smooth. What? <laughs> what? Hey. What do you want? Why does his voice sound so familiar to me? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? Oh my god, no. This is not Xander Mobius. This is not Ranamamia. There's no way. What's the deal between you and her? It is. <laughs> hey, you know my game was the one that came up before yours. What's it like being second best to my game? What's up, dude? How's it going? Oh yeah. You're on this game. Might as well continue the trend. What do you want? Myself, at least. Let me guess. Your name is Stupe. Call me Junpei. Junpei Yuri. Yeah. Cool. I'm going home now. One of the things that I need to remember is to get Mad Bull from the vending machines because if I want to start some social links early, I need Mad Bull for one of the characters. I don't remember what her name is. The, the, the little brat at the bloody park. Uh, vending machine. Here we go. Yes. Wait, what? Oh, maybe I'll buy some next time. So annoying. So, 
This is our new guest. Oh, I don't like it that you're not Dan Warren anymore. God, I need to remember new voice actors. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Nice to meet you, Ikutsuki. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? Yeah, it sure is. I'll be sure to remember that. Here's to a wonderful school year. Yep, I sure, I sure hope you're not going to stab me in the back later on in the game or anything like that. You seem like a decent guy, I'm sure. Are they watching me sleep? What? That's not creepy at all. I mean, yeah, they're monitoring my brainwaves, sure. But they've physically got a camera set up in my room, aimed at my bed, watching me sleep. At any point, one of these could watch me change. That I'm a little bit disturbed by this. He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast asleep. Wouldn't it be really odd if there was like a speaker system in there as well? Like, like they could just hear me like, oh, oh, no, screw you, Mitsuru. Oh look, it's man listening to radio. I'm glad he made a return. Why is there coffins everywhere suddenly? But there's no blood around here. The alleyway looks so much better when there was blood everywhere. Wait, was man listening to the radio always someone at Gekakan High School? I don't remember him actually being a student, but maybe he was. Um. Hi, yeah, no, he got the apathy syndrome, didn't he? But we only ever see, like, a still image. Did we actually get to see him fully just consumed by it? I guess not. Yeah, I mean, you know, God forbid if we got to see that in our 16 plus game. That would be a bit too dark for a game about death. Wait, who the hell's this? You're not Theodore. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Hello there, Mr. Big No Stranger. God, he looks so menacing on this game, I don't know why. <laughs> I think it's the eyebrows. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. As I can see by your contract, your name is Manly Boyface. What the hell kind of a name is Manly Boyface? Your parents must have hated you, kid. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Who the hell is Elizabeth? What happened to Theodore? Where's Theodore? You're pretty late. I don't mean to be overbearing, but please don't make this a regular occurrence. Huh? Who are you, my mother? In any case, you look tired. Why don't you go to bed early tonight? She just wants me to go to bed so she can monitor me again. Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <laughs> you're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. Akihiko, if you're not gonna use the line for anything important other than your penis, then please get off of it. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? It sounds like it. You better go and hide, Yukari, otherwise he might get you. Oh, what was all that noise? Can't a man get any sleep? I'd rather you didn't. I'm, I, I, I'm not decent. Hurry to the first floor. We'll leave through the back. Oh wait, take this just in case. Where, where did she just pull it out of? A short sword. Okay, I guess I'm not using the, the, the speared weapon on this game. Um, someone's at the door. Maybe you should answer it. We have to get to safety. No, but someone's at the door. We need to answer it. Yeah, we're, we're safe. The thing that got inside the building surely can't get back outside again. I've locked the door, so we should be safe for now. The door downstairs was locked, and it still kicked it down. What? We're, we're, you've basically just got us killed. Oh, why does this feel so much more menacing on this game? Oh my god, I think it's because on the original game, it was just like the mask came up and started looking, but now it's like all the creepy hands and it feels worse somehow. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Do something, Yukari, save me. Uh, Yukari, you're supposed to be pointing that at the monster, not at yourself. Hey, y Yukari. Well, you were a lot good, weren't you? It just completely ignored me and went straight for her. Okay, well this is good. Now I can make my daring escape and leave her to die. Um, why am I thinking about the child at this time? <laughs> Do it. Shoot yourself in the head. It's the only way out of this. Oh my god, why is he so happy about this? What the hell? That's a little bit sinister. Oh, Jesus. Um, wow, that actually felt way more ferocious than it should have. Go on, Finettos. Rip him apart. Arm by arm. Limb by limb. Oh, yeah, we actually get to see him do it this time. Because last time, I think it was just a cloud and he was pounding downwards. Oh, God, he physically just slashed his mask off. Well, like, you know, that, that begs the question. Because if we just see him do this in this game... Then where did the other two come from that I have to fight? Because they said it was still moving. 
So it's either two separate shadows or it's legitimately just been slashed into pieces and regenerated as two smaller monsters. I don't know how I feel about this. They changed it from a gun to circle. That's annoying. But this time we know what to do. Use fire, because last time my regular attacking got me killed. Oh, this looks so nice. I love how they've done this. It looks so gorgeous now. And I hit twice when I attack, not just once. Holy crap, brilliant. Oh yeah, this is gonna be great. I just collapsed in front of you, Yukari. How do you think I'm doing? I'm not okay. My head is getting clearer. I can feel someone's presence beside me. You're awake. Ugh, that's always what I like to see first thing in the morning. You? Why are you here? <laughs> it's just to be rude about the whole thing. Oh, thank goodness. You finally woke up. No, but seriously. Why are you here? Hey, um... Yes? I'm sorry I wasn't helpful at all back there. Yeah, you know, thank you for not shooting yourself in the face and not saving me. Turns out I had to save you from yourself. Um, what? What's going on? There's something shining on my bed, I've just noticed. A twilight fragment? What the hell's a twilight fragment? I haven't seen anything. That is a yeah, yeah, I know how you feel. I should hold on to it for now. Is the game going to tell me what it is, though? Or is this just going to say, yeah, hold on to these? No, the game's not going to tell me what it is. That's that's nice. Just random thing on my bed called a twilight fragment. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. I noticed that it left the cherry blossoms. I mean, you know, I would have thought during the dark hour they would have died or something, but I guess plant life is different to our life. Ooh, Tartarus looks so good inside now. It doesn't look as dark either. I mean, it, it looks a lot brighter, so I'm kind of happy about that. Okay, so she says she wants me to kill all the shadows, so it's exactly like it was before. Except the shadows look way more creepier on this game. Oh, we're getting you straight away. That's interesting. You weren't there before. Let's see if he's weak to fire. I don't actually remember what anything's weak to on this game, so it's going to be a trip going back down here. Ah, uh, he's still panicking. Okay, no, he's actually doing it. Never mind. I was going to say, because... They said that they had difficulty summoning their persona, so it would have been really good if they'd have kept it as Junpei and Yukari were very hesitant to pull the trigger, and then, you know, they just grow into it. That's, that's what I thought they should have done, but whatever. I hope they improved on Yukari's accuracy on this game, because nothing annoyed me more on, on Portal than when she kept on missing every flipping shot. Let me handle this one. Just point it to my head and pull the trigger. Yeah, she's still worried about doing it. I love this background that they've got going, like when you summon your persona now. It's so nice. Yeah, you won't be saying that when she starts missing all of her shots. Here we go, big boy. Last one. I wonder how many enemies there are going to be on this floor, because last time I think I had to fight three, and then it introduced me to the split-up system, and then we left. So... Maybe there's going to be like a few more enemies before I split up, I don't know. I have to admire this game's like graphics so much, they're so nice. Yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus. Oh, those are like the briefcases, oh okay, sure. Alright, let's see what's inside this one. Lifestone, interesting, that'll be good for me. I really should have um, read that thing about the treasure chest to be honest, because uh, it did say something about a purple aura, and I think maybe that needs like a key or something, I don't know. I, I didn't read it, so it's just generally concerning me now. You can swing your sword by pressing square. I'm going to be so used to pressing X, and then when I go back to playing Persona Golden, it's just going to be flipping me pressing square. It's not going to be fun. One of the things that I've just realized as well is, um, this game is- oh crap, I wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, he's, weak, he's weak to physical, never mind, okay, that's good. Um, uh, yeah, one of the things that I was going to say was, I hope they've actually added some skills for Dark and Holy, because I don't want there to just be Harma and Mudo again. I know this is a remake, but that doesn't mean they didn't have to include any dark and light skills. We got shuffle time as well. Okay, I'm glad that's still in here. Get a new persona. Brilliant. Uh, what's going on? You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas. Oh, he's just telling me that I've got multiple personas. Okay, yeah. It's it's a, it's a mental disorder, I'm sure. The game is practically forcing me to use my new persona. But like, oh, they're weak to ice as well. What aren't these things weak to? I mean, whatever the case, it's getting my new persona some XP. So, I mean, I can't really complain. Shuffle time. I mean, I'm obviously going to go for a wand to get some XP on here. I'm glad that shuffle time is being introduced in the tutorial. Because I don't think it was in the other game. I think shuffle time came in after the tutorial. The twilight fragment I found in my room seems to be reacting. Oh, that's what those Twilight Fragments are for. Oh, okay, cool. I guess the split-up system isn't on this game then, because the game surely would have told me about it by now. How's everyone doing? Can we go to Tartarus? Everyone can go to Tartarus. Okay, fantastic. Let's go to Tartarus then.
I need the money as it is, so I mean, I'm kind of hoping I get paid a lot. What's this? Why is this here? It's got hands. It's got like a sparkly bit. Can I break this? A feeble lantern. Right, okay, so I get items from breaking them things. Why was that not in the tutorial? Like, it felt like it should have been. Shuffle time, what we got? Oh, Angel. Right, what were you guys weak to again? Uh, how do I how do I check this again? Analyze, that's it. He's weak to wind, fantastic. But we don't know about bashes yet. Is Junpei bash based or what? No, he's slash based, okay. I don't want to use my SP yet though, that's the problem. But I'm going to have to with Yukari. Um... Whoops. So, yeah, that kind of just happened. Oh, crap. Switch, switch, switch. Oh, no. Why is it Junpei going first? All right, let's try and deal as much damage to it as possible. Never mind. Okay, gladly Yukari's going next. We can get an all-out attack on this. If you'd have done this the first time around, I wouldn't have had an issue, but never mind. Uh, nice job, Yukari. I mean, you could have done this last time, and it could have saved me, I don't know, about a minute of loading time and running back in time and talking time, but whatever. At least I got my angel back, though. If you choose a persona that you already have, then all personas who share the same arcana will gain experience. All of them. Not just the one, all of them. As in, all of the Justice ones. That is incredible. That is like the best change ever, because that, that's what I complained about last time. Jinpei, right, who the hell gave you permission to say squad move out? That's my job. Hopefully I'll get uh, another shuffle time from fighting these. I mean, they haven't attacked me and I'm finishing them off with all that attack, so I should get a shuffle time. I want to try and get one that's a HP SP card, because I do need to heal up a little bit. Beside the minor arcana cards that occasionally appear during shuffle time, major arcana cards may also appear. What well, only one of each major arcana card may be acquired once per day. The number of major arcana cards you can acquire, how many times you're going to make me say a major arcana card, can be limited. When you've acquired the maximum number of major arcana cards, an arcana burst will occur and increase the ranks of your minor arcana cards, so collect as many as you can. So... Okay, so, wait, wait, did I just say increase XP? More XP will be acquired until you leave Tartarus. Um... Yes, please. Thank you. Level 5. Now we can create some more personas. This game is fantastic. Holy crap. I can see why so many people are giving this so many better reviews than Portable. Like, this this is the game Portable should have been. This is fantastic. Okay, these are the ones that are weak to ice. I want to try and get you killed first. Okay, well, it's game over. Okay, we're lucky, actually. I genuinely thought that they were going to just go for me then. They, they could have because fire is my weakness. I could probably take these down just by myself. I mean, I've got enough SP for it. All right, now we just switch over to Angel. Good, I'm glad you didn't miss. <laughs> no, my luck, I thought it was going to. Now, if you want to be really nice and give me either the SP cup or a pixie in shuffle time, I'll be amazing. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Now, does the XP increase also work when I get the Arcana of the same shadow? I'm guessing it does because Pixie just leveled up. Oh no, please don't tell me it's a boss room. Is there going to be a teleport? Yes, thank you, Sanctuary. Ruthless Ice Raven. Ha 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 ha, with a name like Ice Raven, I can already tell your weakness is fire. Burn him alive, Junpei. Good man. Let's give him hell, Junpei. Burn him alive. We can get an all that attack out of this. This will be a very easy fight once I switch back to Orphus, who I have just done nothing with and is still likely level 2. Holy crap, that was so weak. Mabufu, no, he can hit everyone with ice. Oh, you know, he's, he's level three. Oh, my mistake. <laughs> he's not going to do that much damage. I think Junpei is going to be my damage dealer for this, but I can still get all that attacks. All that attack level two. They're both going to be below 50% HP, so I would say maybe one more all out attack will do the job. Here we go. Good one, Junpei. Well done. Time for the final all out attack. That's boss number one dealt with already. I'm so happy it wasn't the hands. Oh, well, you know, not a congratulations, just you won, move on. Ooh, Magician. Obtain two Maguru gems. Okay, I could actually work with that. Arcana Burst. Oh, we actually got one as well, nice. When you collected all the major Arcana cards that appear in a day, Arcana Burst will occur and you can acquire a minor, yeah, blah, blah, blah. During the burst, the ranks of minor Arcana cards will increase until you leave Tartarus for the day. Try activating the burst as often as possible. Now, oh man, I would love to get XP, but I think that would be better. You're up against a difficult opponent. But if the intel is available, I can help you. You're not going to be much help to me. That's the worst part. I can suggest the most effective attack based on the enemy's weakness. What? I mean, it's kind of implied that the enemy's weakness is the most effective attack. During battle, press R1 for an assist. The attack most effective against the enemy will automatically be selected. Okay, kind of works better than me blindly doing things, but I kind of like my way of doing things, which is the dumb way of doing things. We'll try using Bufu on it. 
Oh, that's not good. That's very weak damage. Garu, maybe? Yes! Thank you, Yukari. These guys are still weak to fire, so we'll switch over to Junpei. Didn't realize I could switch back over to myself again. That's interesting. Junpei doesn't have that much SP. I think that's probably why I decided to switch to him first. All right, he's got two more uses of his magic this fight, and then that's pretty much it. Oh, not bad damage, you know. But now they're all going to start... I was going to say, now they're all going to start attacking. I don't want to waste his magic. I'm going to just get rid of one of these hands. All right, Bewilder. Okay, that's fine. Oh, he's distressed me. God damn it. Now, I don't really need to attack him again, so we'll get rid of the magic hand, and I think Yukari should have something to help out with distress. She does. Fantastic. It's best not to have him distressed, because he will take more damage and be more susceptible to crit, so I'd rather not have that. Uh oh here comes Bash. Who's he using it on? Oh, oh, Jesus, that's a lot of damage. I'm glad I put Garu on Fornius. Like... I was like, I, I don't know if I'm going to need it, but it's there in case I do, and yeah, I, I evidently I did need it. It's more optimal for me to actually keep using its weakness, so I might as well just keep pinning it down with wind. You're alright to keep using physical attack, because you keep hitting more than once, so that's fine. This next attack should finish it off, if not, Yukari should finish it off. There we go, perfect. Very easy gatekeeper. 782 XP. Oh my god. That is with the XP buff that I get from the card. That's insane. Oh no, it's that thing. No! Uh, I am in trouble. There is no way I'm winning this fight. I, I might actually have to leave. We we we'll try it out. We'll see. I think he was actually the first major boss of Tartarus before the, the, the gate. So I'm thinking maybe he's actually the end of it for now. Increases an ally's attack. I mean, I could use it on myself, but I might need the, I, I'm, I might need the things. I don't know what he's weak to. He probably has the same weaknesses as it did before. I just don't remember what it bloody is. Oh, Junpei, you are honestly so crap. What the hell is this? Yeah, you deserve that. I don't care. You ain't getting rezzed. Yeah, I kind of uh, can't do that right now, Mizuru. I got myself to level 9, and I got myself an Omokane, because apparently that thing is weak to Zio, and at the moment he's the only thing that's got Zio. I'm hoping his magic is good enough, because I've only got 11 SP left. Okay, here we go. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's get rid of this enemy in 11 SP. Using Zio twice. He's gonna one hit me every chance he gets. Look at that damage. Oh, this might actually have to be a comeback. No, this is not really good. Oh, no, not all that attack is just as bad. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be a comeback. Oh, that's not good. Let's see if we can confuse it. If, if we can confuse it, that'd be very nice. You whore. I've got nothing left. My girl, here we go. Yeah, we're all dead. What do we have for items? What do we have for items? I don't, I don't know if I've got anything, man. I've, I've got nothing left. I can't do anything with Junpei down, so I'm going to have to just use healing items. I'm going to have to block, because I genuinely don't know if he's going to use wind again. Oh, he is. Oh, that was good. That was tactical. What on me? Yeah, we ain't going to do this. I'm going to have to come back another day. I'm going to have to waste a day. That's not good. Oh, no, that's not good. Why'd you have to be Maguru, man? Why couldn't you have been flipping... Zio. I mean, I could do it because it still says it does 50 damage to all foes. I mean, regardless of him blocking that, surely that should still do 50. The problem is, I got down there using two all-out attacks and two Zeos, and they had the average of 41 damage. So using two of these isn't exactly going to help me, especially when it's attacks up. I'm going to risk it. I'll save it anyway. Might as well just risk it, see if it does actually do 50. Oh, it still does 50. I'm still not going to beat it. There's no way. Oh, God, here we go. Yeah, rest in peace. Just in case, you never know. I might get lucky and get a crit. It's, it could happen. I'm going to keep guarding with you, though, because I know for what this thing wants to, you know, go for him with wind. Oh. Interesting. I'm going to heal myself up with some rancid gravy. It's going to ruin me, though. It's going to poison me or something. I know it is. Oh, it did nothing to me. Okay, thank God. It's just going to be regular attacks from now on. Attack reverted. Thank God. And it's using Mugger and I got it. Yes, brilliant. Oh, God, he's putting his attack back off again. This is scary, man. Someone please get a critical hit, please. I can't do anything with Junpei. This is so scary. Oh, good dodge. Well done, Yukari. He's so close to death. I can do this. I can win this. Okay, Revival Bead, Yukari. I'm going to have to probably sacrifice Junpei for this fight. Wait, no, she's going next. Yes, perfect. Rancid Gravy, please don't do anything. Just, just leave me alone. Just heal me and nothing else. Good. Thank God. Oh, this is so scary. I can't let her lose. She's my damage dealer at the moment. That's the worst part. They've made you carry so much better, though. I'm so appreciative of that. Yes! <laughs> Thank God! I don't ever want to do that ever again. That was actually terrifying. This floor. There's no mistake in it. Do you recall, boy face? I just want to go to bed. How I told you Tartarus was separated into multiple areas. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is one of those areas. There's a rare chest up here, though, but it's the old document because we're here before the full moon. Yo, boyfish, you by yourself today? Yeah, it looks like it. Everybody else is probably taking a day off after what we all did last night. What does he want? Seriously, why does he keep coming over to talk to me? 
Hey man, I'm gonna get some ramen after school. You wanna come? Oh god, he's a social link. He wasn't a social link for girly face. I don't understand why he's a social link for me now. But so, what persona do I need for him then? Because I genuinely don't know. Wait, you're a magician? I thought Junpei was the magician. Uh, is Junpei something else in this game now? There is only one SP item in here. Are you serious? And I'm going to buy two of the damn things. God damn you. Good afternoon, everybody. I hope to take over as captain, just like in Persona 4. Welcome aboard. I'm Yuko Nishiwaki. Okay, nice to meet you, Yuko. Who is obviously going to be a uh, romantic link. This here's our future team captain. A great runner and places well in competitions. You two are in the same class, right? Miyamoto, keep an eye on the new guy here, okay? Oh man, why do I gotta keep an eye on a new guy? Uh, I'm assuming these are the chariots. Yeah, these, these guys are the chariots. That much is obvious. Anything uh, sporty related is always a chariot. Why, why are we going over to Yuko? Wanna walk home together? Do I have the guts to say that? Actually, no, I'm in a hurry today. Oh, he actually did have the guts to say that. Nice job, you actually did it. I mean, she says she's in a hurry today. So what's stopping me from walking home with her on another day? So obviously she is gonna be a social link as well, unless she's part of the chariot. My side is killing me. I might have overdone it a bit. We've only just started running. Aren't you supposed to be the captain? Don't push yourself or toughen up. I say toughen up, let's be rude. Easy for you to say. Oh, he he likes that. Okay. I've made up my mind. Listen up. I'm gonna make you eat my dust. Yeah, we'll see about that. So unlike with tennis, I've actually got a racing rival on the track team. But he obviously can't keep up with me because he's already in pain. Pathetic. I think I might have twisted my knee. Now he's talking about twisting his knee. First your side, now your knee. Dude, I don't think running is your thing. Why have you taken me to a cafe to have an espresso? Where's my towel? Can you wash this for me? I'm not their mother, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why, why, why would they ask you to do things like that? Just, he's, you just see him hiding his uniform back in his bag. Like, I'll ask her to wash it another day. Yuko seems to be looking out for me. I can feel the two of us have gotten a little closer. Great, what persona do I need for her then? Uh, that's the strength, I think. Strength Arcana, yeah. Okay, great. I've got none of the personas that I need to raise up their Arcanas fast enough. That's going to be fun. All right, everyone. This is who I've been talking to you about. He'll be joining us in student council starting today. Ah, so he's the one. <laughs> That's not the voice I wanted Hidetoshi to have. I'm a first year, and um, I'm still learning the ropes, so please be patient with me. Okay, whenever you make a mistake, I'll make sure to yell at you and hit the table to make sure that I'm, you know, showing my anger. It's getting late. Introductions will be enough for today. Y are you at least going to tell me what days we meet? We meet on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Okay, cool. Meet on days before tests. Right, well, no, no, that's all I needed to know. That's all I needed to know. I didn't care about how I spend my time. I just wanted to know when we meet. I'll see you on Wednesday. Oh my god, I... <laughs> I looked over and I saw that and I was... <laughs> right in the middle of class. Oh god, I... I forgot Kenji was behind me, so I teleported to him to go and hang out with him and that is right there next to me. Good lord. Wow. My mind went elsewhere with that so quickly. Man, this always hits the spot. This flavor's pretty addictive, huh? I'm so glad you're taking me and paying for me because I've only got 89 yen left. But to tell you the truth, this stays between us. I have my eye on someone. Oh, okay. So, yeah. With the girl main character on Portable, you join up with Ryo, who likes him. And yeah, he still likes Miss Canal. So, I'm basically in a social link with someone who's going to go and bang the teacher. But you got to promise you won't tell yeah, yeah, no, I promise I won't tell no one. Whatever gets my social link up with you, I'll just keep it quiet. I feel like the male main character is going to just get lumbered with the biggest idiots going, and I don't know why. You play online games, dude? Uh, yeah, definitely, sure, why not? Just say yes. You gotta check this out. This one's called Innocent Sin. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I don't see any other players. A girl in red approaches me. I don't see any other players. A girl in red is approaching me. I Obviously, she's a player. Sup, XD. Oh, God, you're one of those, are you? ASL. Oh, no. I've had enough of listening to that on the internet for one lifetime. Oh, wait. Are you a... I suppose you meant to say noob. I don't know why you called it nub. Whatever. You are, huh? Oh, wow. You haven't even finished making your cow yet. Yes, the news. The default skin was, the, was for real. I... What the hell? Can you not be normal? So, what are you going to call your character? All I see is no data. Ooh. Hey, I've got a good name for you. How about Tatsuya? That's perfect, in my opinion. I'll change mine to Maya, okay? I'm assuming she's referencing something. Have a little deja vu. Sure. What social link do I need for this online persona? I need a hermit. Okay, cool. Uh, Using a shared computer. You can use a shared computer on the first floor lounge to run or purchase software. What? 
All software is single use only and can use to purchase from Mangastar Net Cafe. What the hell are you talking about? Digital cram school. What is this? Learn about a variety of subjects. Oh, is this something to improve my academics? Whether you're brilliant or average, your journey here begins by answering questions all the same. I should try some questions in the areas I'm studying right now. Oh, this is a good way to improve my knowledge. Brilliant. I finished answering a challenging yet satisfying set of questions. I feel like I've gotten better at thinking outside the box. I don't even think for myself on this game. Nice. Academics is now average. Perfect. Needed to go a little bit higher though. Now, is Bun Kitchi going to tell me about how he sells fresh mackerel? Welcome. What would you like to order? Our special today is a fresh mackerel. Well, let's go back to the school and find the leaf. I knew that they were going to keep something the same. I just don't actually remember where the bloody um thing is. Oh, I've literally found the right area. I didn't expect it to <laughs> be right where I thought it was going to be. Well, it looks like I'm going to have to get my hands on another hierophant just to appease these two. Oh, he's last time I'm sure he was laying on the bed. Now he's just sitting on a chair. What are all of you doing here? Well, we came here to see you, but instead we found your friend. Be done here, Aki. That is not the voice I wanted him to have. I wanted him to have like a much deeper, more aggressive voice for some reason. I don't have time for this shit. You're... Uh, yes? Never mind. Okay, good talk. Why does Boom Kitchy have my number? <laughs> How do you use the telephone, dear? <laughs> I want to message Manly Chan. I mean, I've already got the strength for Karna. I might as well just hang out with her. Like I said, Golden Week, school's closed. I can't hang out with anybody else and build a social links. So I might as well leave the outside people when I'm on holiday or on the weekends when I don't have nothing to do. Not again. What do you mean, not again? What's happened? It's the same stupid prank every time. Talk about unoriginal. What even... What, what happened? What, who's pranking you? There's a piece of gum on Yuko's locker. Um... Gross? I feel like girl with brown hair is, uh, oh, girl with bright hair is going to be the one who's putting gum on her locker. Is that your new boyfriend? Why does she say new like that? Like, like is, is she very popular with the guys? On to the next one already, I oh god, see. she is. We're not dating. He's just a friend from the team. Okay, yeah, so she, she's obviously being bullied by these two. One of these two is definitely putting the gum on her locker, but she's so stoic about the whole thing. I would have hit them both. That girl in the black tights, we went to the same middle school. Back then, there was this boy on the basketball team who asked me out, and we started dating. But, turns out, he was seeing her at the same time. Oh, and <laughs> she's blaming you for that. Okay, I see how this is going. When she found out, she said I stole her boyfriend, even though I was a victim too. God, you're nothing but a two-bit, two-time in thief. Oh, the crap, she's ranked three already. I've ranked her up more than I have with the track team. Whoops. <laughs> I've been hanging out with the manager more than actually going to the track team. Hi, hi, I was waiting for you. Yeah, I could see that. So, um, I'm drunk. It's Monday morning. It's like 8.30. What the hell are you doing drinking? Save me, Tatsu. I'm sick of my job. No time to party. What is your job? I need my game and drinky time, but I'm haunted by deadlines. Irregardless, irregardless, what? W wouldn't it just be regardless? Oh, irregardless isn't a word. Yeah, no, I knew that. I was I was so confused when you brought that up. I'm running a little late. I'll be right back, Kay. Um, sure. I was on the phone with my mum. Whenever we talk, it's always the same. Ah, uh, let me guess, let me guess. It's going to be something along the lines of, where are you going with your life? You are a disappointment. Please tell me that's what it is. It'll be hilarious. All she cares about is marrying me off to some dude. Ah, that was going to be my second guess. Never mind. Let's plan our wedding then. Please tell me I've got the guts. Yes, I do. Thank God. Even without meeting me IRL, take me Tatsuya. Oh God, she wants it. We're in there, mate. We don't even know who she is or what she looks like. For all I know, this could be another guy. The other night, I got a little drunk and kind of passed out at Polonia Mall. <laughs> that's very attractive. This dude was like, you'll never get a man looking like that. Ugh. She's ranked four already. Holy crap. I need to start getting hermits. Now that old lame I told you about, he was hanging around Polonia, so... If you see him, don't be nice. I saw him on this weird TV show too. Oh my god. Wait, is this the introduction to the guy from the, the bloody... I can't remember his name. Y you know who I'm on about. The, the, the guy who runs the scam. Damn it, what's his name? Why can't I think of his name? I, I know he's the devil. Where? You sound, uh, very brave. This is it, right? Do you see any other monorails? The enemy is acting strangely. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, Junpei's gonna go running in there now, isn't he? We should be careful, because, you know, he gets surrounded at some point. So I'd rather not get surrounded myself, just in case anything happens when you do get surrounded. Crap, what are these guys weak to? Alright, let's try using ice, see if it's weak to ice. I mean, might as well just cover all the bases. It's not weak to ice, crap. Wind, maybe? Alright, that's one down. Really? 
God damn it, you're supposed to be the accurate one. Don't miss him, don't miss him. Good, well done. Jesus, that was scary. We're immediately going straight in for another fight. I'm... Oh, mate, I'm not even prepared for this. Please tell me he's weak to lightning, at least. Okay, good. We found his weakness. I need to try and save as much SP as possible, because the Priestess isn't weak to anything from what I remember, so it's best that I have as much SP as possible to use magic attacks. Well, we're picking up speed. I thought that was obvious. I'd also like to point out, she said, like, not to let, um, the people that have been transmorgified, or whatever it's called, it know that anything's happening. So when these people realise their monorail is back, like, four stations beforehand, they're gonna get confused, aren't they? Still got BJ written on your breasts, I see. Oh my god, we have half an hour to beat her. That's actually so much better than eight minutes. Okay, well... Oh, we need to plan out our attacks and our course of action. Jesus, oh god, we haven't got that much time. All right, if I remember, don't use ice against her. I mean, that much is obvious from the cold air that's in here. We don't have anything to like drop her stats as far as I can see. God damn it. Oh, increase an ally's defense for three turns. Yeah, there we go. Something beneficial for me, at least. I need that for more, more than anything. Ice storm. Crap, I'm weak to ice. Oh, I'm not weak to ice. No, it's fire she's weak to. Yes, perfect. I've never been so happy to have Valkyrie. Uh, what's invitation to chaos? What is this? What's she doing? The monorail is starting to shake. Huh? What do you mean starting to shake? Is she ripping it apart? What? 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 Um, whoops. Uh, yeah, there's, there's, there's definitely no time to sit there and talk and joke about. Okay, she's summoning. I knew she was going to do something like this. There's only two of them. Okay, fantastic. Uh, what's, what's, what's weak to what? What's weak to what? Um, all right, let's use ZL on that one. I don't know. Crap, he's not weak to anything. Oh god, what is he going to be weak to? I, I can't remember if she eats them or if one of them heals her. I know they do something. Okay, that one was weak to, some, to, to fire. Are you weak to zero at least? I mean, I'm only switching back to him because he's got, like, extra power. No. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Boothola. No. You're weak to wind at least? I need to find out what their weaknesses are because if she's summoning them again... Okay, that's weak to wind. Perfect. Need to heal up Junpei though. Oh god, I don't have anything to heal. All I mean, I've, I've got cure water, but I've only got one. All right, what's this one weak to? Um... Okay, the other one was wind and lightning. You're either going to be weak to ice or you're going to be weak to fire. We'll, we'll test out ice first. Okay, he's weak to ice. Beautiful. No, not invitation to chaos. How much is that going to take it down by? The is going even now. No, what? What? No, that, that's, that's wrong. On so many levels, that's just wrong. Okay, we need to get rid of this now. No, ice storm. There's no way. She's too powerful. The only thing is, is like, I've got the ice shoes on for Yukari and she's not dodging any of the ice attacks. Oh, uh, I'm going to have to start the fight again. God damn you, man. Right, he takes no damage from ice. Let's switch to him. Problem is, though, I've got no use of my magic with um, Manly now, so I'm going to have to keep using magic with everybody else. Invitation of Chaos. Okay, right. She's going to drop it by about 10 minutes now, my bloody luck. No, look at that. that. That's insane. That is ridiculous. That is a whole 15 minutes gone. I've forgotten what all of their weaknesses are already. Crap. Not going to end well for me at all, is it? Okay, that's weak to that. That's fine. Uh, he's weak to, uh, to fire. Cool. Sweet. Oh, he's also weak to Fizz, seriously? Right, so this is the guy that's going to be weak to Ice, 100%. If I had... Oh, no, because Mabifu would just heal her up, wouldn't it? Yeah, that's not, not going to end well for me. Jesus Christ, her health is not going down. Oh, cool. Starting off with a very strong Ice Storm. Love it. Uh, Cure Water, I guess. Why would you go for Yukari with that? God damn it, man. Okay, we, could, we might still win this if she doesn't summon Chaos or whatever it was called. Uh, ice and Wind. Perfect. I like how Masuru was like, try switching teammates to hit the enemy's weakness, and it's like, even if I switch teammates to hit the weakness, I'm not getting an all-out attack. You're, like, I'm physically stuck here until this thing drops. I'm gonna have to waste a bead on Yukari. I can't have anyone die. Like, I know she's gonna Ice Storm next. Yeah, see? That was tactical. God damn. Yukari has the Ice Shoes. I don't get why she's not trying to dodge the ice. I know my health's getting low. I don't have anything to recover with. Okay, use it on Manly, please. Good, yes. That's a wasted attack. Perfect. That's going to help me out big time. Oh, she is so close to death and we've only got two minutes left. Oh my god, it's dead. Jesus Christ, that was actually more scary on this game. Oh, if I didn't have Jack Frost, that would have been it. I would have just lost that entirely. I mean, you know, we still have another one minute 30 seconds before we collide in with the other monorail, but I'm sure we should be fine. Just, you know, stand about for a little bit. Do you see any brakes? I don't see any control rooms. How does this monorail work? You guys good? The train stopped. You can get up now, Yukari. I'm like drenched in sweat. Let's be honest here, Junpei. 
It's P, isn't it? Exams are coming up, so why don't you take today to relax? Yeah, um, the first thing I'm going to be doing is going online with Maya, because, yeah, she wants me. But I'm going to be doing that next episode. Well, that's where I'm going to be ending it. Oh, God, that was scary. So the next time I play, obviously, I'm going to go up to the next full moon boss, which I think are the Empress and the Emperor. So I'll be doing that one. But if anyone did enjoy, consider leaving a like, subscribing, and commenting how bad I was playing this game. I know full well nobody's going to comment, but, you know. So until then, see you next time. Thank you very much for watching.